And hello everyone, welcome, 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 welcome to a new co-op Hoi 4 series, Hearts of Iron 4. Um, we are playing uh, the U.S. States mod, as you can probably tell, as you see all wonderful, uh, not all of them, but most of the states, when I zoom out. Um, I'm playing as the state of Minnesota. My co-op partner Chuck is playing as the state of Michigan. We are playing with Kaiser Reich, uh, of course the state's mod, and Faction Manager. And so we're, we've already done our opening moves. We've had the test out. We've had a few crashes, figured out that increased resources doesn't work. And you have to play as the entire world. Otherwise, um, the state's mod apparently wants to crash. So without further ado, we're going to dive, I'm going to actually tool this speed back a bit, and we're going to dive into it. Can I still pause it with spacebar? I cannot pause it with spacebar. Dang gum it. All right, well, there you have it, folks. So, what to do, what to do, what to do? Yeah, I can pause this game. Got it. Sweet. Yep, pause it as you need it. Um, ba -ba 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 so we are trading and doing pretty good there. Sweet. Does this give us any civilian factories? We have all. Oh yeah. There we go. Having that still's worth it, man. That still is good stuff. All right. Did I start a timer? I did start a timer. I'm not gonna let this thing go over too much. Um. Okay. So here we are. You're telling me um, no orders. Yeah, of course you have no orders. Low manpower. All right. We need to have this event that happens that talks about the uh, dissolution of the United States. I can't remember when it happens, though. Should, uh, um, should have it on the fifth day, but I don't... I don't... Uh, they may have changed the mod because we're already broken up. Yeah, you start broke. You start always start broken up, but then there's an event that normally triggers that says this is a dark day. Yada yada yada. What government type do you want to be? But I just can't remember when that happens. I read. Um, I read it was the fifth day, but we're well past the fifth day. Yeah, we are. Maybe it'll take some time to kick in. Maybe this mod doesn't like Kaiser Reich or Road to Fifty Six. We're not playing with Kaiser Reich. What am I talking about? Oh, no, it is happening, because Kansas is fascist now. I guess it just has to go state by state. Oh, here we go. Restrictions on Bulgaria lifted. So we got the state of Florida. Tennessee. Ooh. What are you? Tennessee Empire. Yeah, I guess it just kind of goes state by state. So we should be... Oh, here we go. The day the Earth stood still... Let's prepare for the worst. And um, here we go. We'll show them that Minnesota is strong. So we're going to go fascist. So we're now the Minnesota Empire. Per Persia conceded to British demands. And we now have Marcus Smith. So we're now fascist. Did that do anything for our manpower? Of course not. Of course not. Well, what are we doing here? What are we doing? What are we doing? What are we doing? Command power. Uh. Yep, there we are. So now we just wait. Mm hmm. The Michigan Empire. Look at that. It'll be interesting to see what the first war is. Um, I'm going to bet it's New York versus Connecticut. Communism. Yeah, yeah, it probably is a good thing to see what. Okay, so Wisconsin went fascist. Iowa went socialist. South Dakota went fascist. North Dakota went fascist. Oh, Iowa. 
Is that really the best move by you? Illinois I'm not sure. Communist. Indiana's fascist. Ohio's communist. What about Ontario? Ontario went fascist. Good. Manitoba, I think the Republic of Manitoba. Wow, they added some weather in here. <laughs> you can actually see the weather. It's zero degrees right now in Minnesota. That sounds miserable. They added time. Yeah, they did. Remilitarization of the Rhineland. Nothing wrong. I mean, that can't. There's nothing that can bad that can come out of that. Nothing. Not a bit. Let's see, how are these military factories doing? Ah, uh, they're getting there. God, we gotta, we, we gotta make up some deficits. We need manpower, too. We ain't got none of that. So I'm looking at what this action is because this is new to me. Yeah. Where do you see that? Have I just completely missed that? It's the gavel. The gavel. Gavel button. Oh. This is just going to be lovely. Yeah, they've added a lot since I played. So apparently I can promise a peace. Yeah. Uh, am I going to get a war in 90 days? I don't want to do that. Yeah, but what are you going to gain from it? You're going to gain stability, and you already have 100% stability. Yeah, that's and it'll, true. it'll retard your political power, so I wouldn't do it. Yeah, we're not going to do that. That's just that's a bad idea. Goodness. Yeah, this is going to be interesting. This is going to be a learning curve right here. What am I doing? I know what I should be doing with those troops. I probably need to move these guys to the border. Just for kicks and giggles. See what's going on in Iowa and Minnesota. Manpower is not the problem, it's my production. No, my manpower is a big problem. Big, 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 big problem. What's your manpower sitting at? Um, a big old goose egg. Ouch. Yeah, ouch is right. Ouch. Ouch is very much right. Okay, yeah. Yeah, I'd say that hurts. I've got 25,000 at least. I got zip, nada. Which means I'm going to have to snake down the uh, whole focus tree that... I mean, I was going to snake down it anyways, but apparently I'm going to be snaking down it much sooner rather than later. Right. Yeah. Hmm, what am I going to do with my first 200 political power? Burn it. Burn it on something useless. That's what I would do. Oh, man.
And gotta be getting close on some of this. All right, that'll be done soon. Tech-wise, uh, we still got a little bit of time. And recruit and deploy. Yeah, we're still working on that. Let's see. Tell you one thing, we can build some roads, that's for sure. Hey, industrial effort. That is wonderful. National focus. We need to get over here. So we're going to have to go down this whole nationalism tree. There we go. Not that that's busted, but there you have it. Oh, what am I going to do? What am I going to modify first? I don't know. Here we go. So we're we're slowly bridging that gap. Slowly. Hey, we're now producing artillery. Stockpiling, I should say. Time. Oh, we got several days left on that. Yuck. National character is that? No, that's not new. Modify the government. What do we want to do first? Um, probably a political advisor. But what do you mean we can do something? We can't do a oh, faction manager. Get out of here. Alright, so I guess we just wait. We wait, we wait, we wait. That's all we can do. Alright, so they got some troops. God, there's a river crossing. Ugh. The good news is taking out Wisconsin is going to be relatively easy. There we go. What did we just research? We just researched da, 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 electronical mechanical engineering. There we go. That is good news. Um, but up, up, but up, uh, so there we have it. Command power. Uh, we 
Absolutely. So it can be spent on operations. Yep. I definitely probably need to play this before diving back into it. Boy, am I going to learn a whole lot. Um, ba -da -ba -ba -da -ba, ba -da -ba -ba -da -ba. Let's see. Still doing pretty well on time. Golly, this whole manpower thing in Minnesota. I do remember this. Like you have, I have to remind myself that we're dealing with 1936 population, and the state populations were distributed somewhat differently than what they are today. While Minnesota has a decent population today, it doesn't have the strongest. Um, Ohio is a strong state. I do remember that. They got a lot of manpower. Michigan's another one. Another good choice. New York, of course, is always a strong choice. It Free civilian factories. What? Oh, I guess we do have free civilian factories. What do I need to do? I don't even know what to do with all these free civilian factories. I guess we'll do another round of rail upgrades. I mean, it can't hurt, can it? Get that infrastructure in Minnesota, like up to par. I like it. <laughs> Some point I'll probably need to start building anti-air. And probably an air base. Do I even have an air base? I don't think I do. Um, let's do that instead. Can I build an air base? I can build an air base. Ooh, yeah, that would make the most sense. What am I doing? Let's let's do that. We need a good air base. Um, ha 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 ha. Yeah, we're gonna have to definitely. Ba -da -ba -ba, do that and then nationalism and then I think we're going to get militarism nope oh yep that's it recruitable population beautiful um I would love to get rid of this whole volunteer only but ooh uh, actually limited conscription is on the table um yeah that's gonna be the first thing we do what did that do did that did that change do we have any manpower all well, depends on your core population uh, no that didn't do a lick of good oh gee Manetti because my core population. is 2.78 million. So this is going to be interesting. 10,000 in manpower? 10 to 15,000? Yeah, I think it all got sent to training. That's exactly what happened. It all got used. What a unique little conundrum there. Well, it should go to training. Yeah, it went directly to training. So we're back to zero manpower, boys. Oh, that is just... This is going to be a fun playthrough. Not necessarily a bad one, but it'll be fun. All right, well, let's see. We Oh, there we go, open the political sphere. That is beautiful. So we can do some more decisions. Do another promise of peace. What does improved worker conditions do? 
Uh, I don't need any stability. Um, we need to go ahead and keep snaking down this. I get we got low manpower. Military high command, do any of you do anything that I want you to do? No. Theorist would be nice. Industrial concern. Um, political advisor. That's not a bad one. That's also not a bad one. That's definitely not a bad one. Um, not really sold on that one. Uh, balanced approach gives you additional stability. No. Daily political power. Daily fashion. Personality cult. All right, we'll figure that out. We got to choose our new techs. Yeah, everybody loves a good new tech. At least I love a good new tech. Um, it is still 1936. All right. Well, let's go ahead and start doing this. All right, back to you. Lessons of history, not bad. That's stability. Yeah. I'm actually okay with that. All right. What did that do? I just sent more divisions in the training. We're going to have to continually build this thing up. Gee, Manetti. But, it, yep, it sent some more divisions in the training. Good for us. How are we doing here? Oh, we got to make a lot of guns. A lot of guns. Starting to stockpile some support equipment, though, which is a good thing. We may taper off on the artillery and bump up the guns. Bump up those guns, baby. All right, let's see. Still good on time. All right, well, as we prep for this war to come, a little bit of time there. Um, legal status of women. What is traditional roles? That would limit. Ooh, limited rights. I think we will be taking limited rights. Get this thing built up, dear lord. It's been far more challenging than I thought. Just from a population standpoint, let me point that out. Everything else seems to be going pretty stinking smooth right now. You know, I don't remember getting to pick what uh, government type you had. I, I remember always having whatever you started with and having to convert your government type. That's like, if you're not playing the U.S. States mod, that's exactly how that works. Yeah, but I, I thought the U.S. States mod did the same thing for some reason. As long as I remember playing it, not to say that it wasn't that way, you always kind of got your choice, which was kind of nice. Yeah, and it may have been that way. I just look at some of these national characters, and they don't fit the mod, right? Oh, yeah, most definitely. And some of that may be that we're using the Road to 56 in tandem with it. Hey, there's Yugoslavia and Bulgaria. No Croatia, though. And definitely no Carpathian Empire. All right. Gosh. Well, I've got some submarines patrolling the Great Lakes. <laughs> That Just is, so you know. That is good to know. Chicago better watch out. Chuck's got them subs, baby. He got them subs. Man 
Yeah, we're still hurting for manpower over here. Though it has gone up. Manpower. That's new for me. But yeah, I think you're going to be hurting for uh, manpower for a while. Oh, Czechoslovakia starts their border fortification project. What's Man. your political power per day? Um, we're earning roughly 1.2. Okay. You know, we'll say this. Division-wise, we, we've got divisions in training. Uh, about the only good thing that we're doing is we got plenty of civilian factories from the trade and we're slowly cutting our deficit on guns needed guns that need to be produced and on the other two on artillery and then uh, support equipment we're actually doing okay um, I just really really I need some more I need some more freaking manpower. Oh my gosh. I wonder how war support wins in. I wonder if the higher war support the less you're justifying. Uh, war support represents the willingness of the people to uh, prosecute a war to the finish enacting many laws and preparing your nation for going to war effectively requires high war support. I mean... And anyways, this this episode is probably going to be a little longer. We're going to go 30 minutes on this, and we'll shorten the rest of them. Uh, to finish my thought, as my phone was getting blown up with text, I will say this. It probably does not help us that war supports at 1%. However, when World War II officially breaks out, it should get better, if that makes any sense. All right, so in the meantime, we are still researching stuff. Which is lovely. I always gotta love that. And then. I hate to say it, but I think my first thing is gonna be taking over Hoosier State. They're a good target. I think my first one's probably gonna be either Illinois, not, not Illinois. Wisconsin or Iowa? Don't listen to me. Do not listen to me, because apparently I'm not going to tell you the truth. I need to keep on monitoring the time. We've got about two and a half minutes. Uh, hopefully we'll get some more. Uh, yeah, we'll probably get that in two and a half minutes, which means maybe we can modify the government twice. Because we need to get that recruitable population. Although I am seeing my army, which is a good, which is really good news. We're now up to sixty-one thousand manpower in the army, which is a really good improvement. But we're going to make that even better because we're going to give women limited rights. We're going to boost that some more. Wow, there's climate acclimatization now. Is there? Yeah, dude, man, I, I'm telling you, it's like I have not played this game. I, I'm going to venture and say that I may have played it in the early part of this year. It may not have been in last year. Last year, what am I saying? I'm not making any sense. I may have played it a little bit in the start of 2018, but it very well could have been 2017 the last time I played this game. Largely because Civ Six came out. Played a little bit of PUBG, got killed in PUBG. I mean, you know, just kind of all those normal things that go on if you're me and you play a first-person shooter. All right, let's go ahead and give women some limited rights. All right, 
And that should. We have some more political power. Even better. We can continue to snake down this. Oh, manpower. Ugh. And what can we do here? States mandate. Power and politics. Uh, I kind of like that personality cult. That wouldn't be a bad one. Balanced approach gives you stability. Ooh. That's tough. That is tough. I guess the real question becomes, do we add a political advisor? Oh, and that conflict finally broke out. All right, I'm going to hit pause here. Spanish Civil War is a great way to end this. And we're going to go ahead and make a cut. And we'll pick up in the next episode, guys. Hope you all enjoyed the first one. If you did, leave it a like. And if you're not subscribed to the channel and you want to see somewhat regular updates, hit that sub button. We'll catch you next time.